Okay, we are at the Hawaii State Capitol at the moment. Um, we're live here. You can hear ho horns honking. There's a protest going on, a demonstration, a uh, reaction to uh, Governor Ige's um, announcement yesterday that will allow uh, construction to continue under 30 meter telescope, TMT. A lot of people not happy about that. I'm not happy about that. <laughs> So we got people on both sides of the street here telling people what they feel. Aole TMT, no TMT, thanks for coming out. Why are you here? Why are you here, bro? Hello, why are you here? <laughs> Shai. We're gonna go walk across the street. Kukiai Mauna, thank you. Aloha. People are honking. Protect. protect but take Mauna Kea, thank you. We'll go across the street and we'll see. That is the Hawaii State Capitol building and on the fifth floor is the offices of the governor and his house is actually down the street a little way. So let's go across the street and see, uh, see what's going on here. So this wasn't a planned demo. This is a reaction to... Uh, Governor Ige's um, announcement yesterday, so. I'm crossing uh, Baritania Street. There we go. Bunch of people here getting a lot of uh, reaction. Thank you so much. Aloha Aina. Aloha Aina. You want to tell me why you're here? You're, you're live on the internet. You want to tell us okay. why you're here? I'm here in support of Mauna Kea, of course. Um, I believe that we should all come together and help save what we have. Because that's all we have and we shouldn't destroy it. And I just hope that people will realize that and have, take to heart of what the people of Hawaii know that if they can just respect that, then that would be just great. Thank you, and I'm You're gonna welcome. I'm gonna take a look at your sign. We are all Mauna Kea. We all are Mauna Kea, and you have the shirt, Kukiai. I do. Mauna, what does that mean? What is that? Kukiai Mauna is to stand firm, stand up for Mauna Kea. Stand up for Mauna Kea. Thank you so much. You're Thank you. Aloha. <laughs> Aloha. Have uh, signs. Anybody want to say something? You're live on the internet. Aloha, I know. Check Mauna Kea. We are here every Wednesday from 3:30 till traffic is full. Please join us and show okay. our dissatisfaction with Governor Ige's uh, public announcement. Right. Mahalo. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Aloha, I know. Thank you. There's unity here from it's not only a Hawaiian thing. <laughs> uh, oh, sorry. Um, turns out that uh, actually, like, basically, my I want to ask. Tacos, I want to ask. Say that again. The insurrectos. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It turns out that my family is actually what's left of Hill. We're live. We're live on the internet. Can I? Can I? Uh, Can you, uh, we're live on the internet right now. Tell me why uh, you're here and the significance of your uh, sign. Okay, so the sign says um, TMT Ibagsak. Um, so a couple of different uh, important reasons I'm here. One, um, the sign says Filipinas say TMT Ibagsak um, because I want to honor the decolonial Pinais who have been organizing in Hawaii to um, build political collaboration between uh, the progressive movements in the Philippines and um, the struggle for self-determination here in Hawaii. And I support uh, the struggle against the TMT um, because I do see it as an issue of, of, uh, of Kanaka Maoli Kanaka Uivi self-determination. Um, 
and so uh, so I support it for that reason. Um, I also is that enough? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I should probably be enough. No. <laughs> but you want, you want if you can if you want you can tell us your name sure. or any group you're with. Oh my with. God, is this live? Yeah, it is live. Like, sorry. I feel super embarrassed. That's not right. Very articulate. My name is Melissa Casombal Salazar. Okay. And um, yeah, and I'm also uh, a researcher, and uh, the ethics of the research uh, on Mauna Kea are just abhorrent. Uh, the mountain deserves better. Um, the ancestral stewards uh, deserve better. Um, the UH and the state have. Kuliana, that they're not upholding. So, right. um, so yeah. TMT, Great. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, that's the state capital. The wavy signs. <laughs> you want to say something why you're here? And let me see. Let me see what your sign is. I got you. Kukiai Mauna, Kukiai Mauna, Ole TMT. Tell me why you're here and uh... Well, I am here because after hearing the response of Governor Ike, and I'm really disappointed because I just feel like we've been uh, kind of led on. And I have a message for the governor that might get him to kind of understand how we feel with no disrespect, but we really will not be Iggy Nord, okay? And I That's say that funny. with I aloha, like that. <laughs> with a little sense of humor, yeah. but I really wish you would look deep into what is really at stake here. And we're not only talking about our cultural sacred respect, but this has been an ongoing thing as far as the disrespect to the Hawaiian culture and just to the way we treated our land. So it's a wake up call and this is the very last time we're gonna allow anything like this as far as the disrespect because this Mauna Avakea, as you know, is a prime resource and I know they know it. And it hasn't passed the environmental yeah. specifications for right. so-called conservation land. Right, it's that, conservation land. It's got 13 observatories you. on it already. Right, and most of them are not functional. And if you remember, at the last Ohamini, one of the scientists came back, I think this was their last straw to pick up, saying that they need this in case there's an asteroid. <laughs> hitting Earth that they can measure. So my question is, can you guarantee us right. that that asteroid will not hit us? Right, right. And of course, there was dead silence. Right. Which there would be if it did hit us anyway. <laughs> but you know what? We don't want to use fear tactics. That's not the way to get people's attention. Okay, we've had enough of that in our society. So I say this with Kapu Aloha. We're here because we care. And the message is, we need you to support and start caring for the people of Hawaii and for what we represent. And what we represent right now is protection for that, right. for Mana Avakea and for all sacred sites throughout the world because we're not the only ones putting out this plea. This right. is worldwide. So no. listen to the signs. Now the governor said that the construction can uh, continue. What uh, what are people going to do if, when the trucks start rolling? Well, I think Lana Kila put it very well when he said it is dangerous for them to even attempt to go up to the heights that they're going to be taking this equipment. And his concern is the safety of those that are involved in the project, in the construction of the project. So there again, here we echo the same, same message. Let us think before we do. And let us think about all the implications and not just the money. Because right. when we're talking about the safety of human life, that there's no dollar sign attached right. to that. Right. So I'm really concerned about that and so are they. And we will stand strong for that, their safety as well. It's not just about some of the things that we're discussing 
to protect and why we're so right. firmly behind this. Terrific. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, you can tell me your name if you want to. I am not only GMO on Facebook. <laughs> Other than that, Auntie Sandy Nohanani. Aloha. Aloha. Thank you. Mahalo. <laughs> Walking down here so we can see the sign. That's it. Uh, Let me see your sign. Aole. Hey, my mama, Aina. Tell me what it means for the people watching on the mainland. I mean, on the continent. It means no. It means take care of the land. Take care of the land so it can feed us. Yeah? That makes sense. Thank you. <laughs> Candace here. Show me your sign. Tell me what your tell me why you're here, what your sign means. Okay, so Piu Lama Mauna Kea to cherish Mauna Kea, to exercise Kapu Aloha, to act out of love for the Mauna and to stand for the Mauna with Aloha. Oh, I see. Yes. So Thank that you. is not what Ige is proposing. Boy, so. sure is. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what is going through Ige's mind. Boy. Thank you. So we have we have people on both sides of the street. A lot of support. You hear hear honks, people honking in the support of the group. This group just came out very uh, as a reaction to um, as a reaction to uh, Governor Ige's announcement yesterday. The construction on the uh, 14th telescope. 14th Observatory on Mauna Kea can continue, so people are not, that's a good sign, we are not defeated, absolutely, thank you so much. You want to tell us, we're live on the internet, you want to oh, say, we're live. <laughs> yes we are, How do we do that? <laughs> we're, we're pretty smart, you want to wow. tell us why you're here and, and what your sign means? And oh, well I'm here standing in solidarity with uh, my uh, friends and family on uh, holding it down on by the island. I see, okay. I didn't know what was going on in Honolulu today, but oh. somebody said something was happening. So yeah, was so, so you just came down. How'd you hear about it? Um, I think it was a post that Candace put up. Uh, I don't know Candace. I see. Somebody else tagged me. I put the call out on my Facebook page asking what's happening in Honolulu. I see, that's great. Yeah, and then I was like, oh, that's great. Well, thanks for, thanks for coming out. Mahalo, Mahalo. Mahalo. thank you. <laughs> if, uh, Young and old kids here. Uh, earlier we saw some people do a hula. <laughs> yeah, so let's, catch, let's catch a lot of people getting, uh, seeing the signs. Anyway, I wanted to bring you a short uh, news. Uh, It goes, it goes on my um, live stream page and then on Facebook and Twitter and stuff. Oh, wait, what is your... On Twitter, I'm hdug, H-D-O-U-G. So okay. it'll be right there and, cool. and then it records afterward too. So. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to cut away for a moment. Oh, well, there's... Gino, let's ask him. Hey, well, you're live on the internet. Can you tell us? Uh, you just came back. You were up on the on the Mauna. Tell us what's going on and what are people going to do? They, the governor said that uh, um, construction can continue. So people that uh, we slowed, we had slimmed down our numbers for a while because you know it's kind of going on and on. Yeah. And so we just kind of were waiting for the call. We're not surprised that the governor made the decision. That so what people are going to do, they're going to come right back into the Mauna because we figure, I figure at least in myself, that at the most we have maybe two weeks before vehicles start moving again uh, and construction really does resume. Yeah. We would say they have, they can go right ahead and start 
building. So. so people have been actually camped up there for... 62 days now. 62 days, yeah, that is amazing. <laughs> That's amazing, That's yeah. great. And you were up there for a while too. 38. Wow, really? Yeah, yeah 38 Whoa, days. Whoa, yeah. that is pretty good. And it was cold too. It was very cold. It dropped down to 17 degrees at one point. 17 one degrees. Yeah. It was nothing to have a 21 degree night. So. Oh my God. 17 was intense. You're yeah. thinking maybe of going back? Uh, oh, oh, I am going back. You are After going the back. Seven, I'm getting a tooth extraction and then I'm going back right up there. Like I'm leaving the hospital and getting on that plane. Wow. I pull it out, I gotta go. All right. Well, good luck. <laughs> good luck. Do you want to tell us who you are? Or I'm Tina D'Angelo McIntyre. There you go. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> and I should turn around to show where we are. We are at on the grounds of the state capitol where we have some banners and uh, a version of the Hawaiian flag, Hawaiian national flag flying. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna cut away for now. If something happens, we. Will